it's very sunny at the moment and the neighbours are cutting down the grass over there. It's the first time I'm using this, this is the uh, 650 with um, a new wide angled lens so maybe I'm rather dark and maybe I'm rather light but I'm going to make the best of it today and also I've put on the camera the Rode um, microphone and I'm now going to chance walking underneath the air conditioning so I don't get wet. So this vlog is about Kotlic, it's like a Serbian goulash. Predrag's making it because our friend Bruce is here today. Uh, I can already see that the zoom is automatically going in and out, but you'll tell me if it's a viewable, a viewable vlog or not. So today it's me playing with a new camera, with the uh, wide angled lens, and I hope uh, the quality is a lot better than what it normally is. Let's see. How's it going? It's gorgeous. The sun is shining, so life is always good. The fire is lit and it smells wonderful. Even even just the wood smoke. So it's a shame you can't get smell o blog. Oh you mean Fantastic. scratch and sniff scratch and sniff video? Yeah, kind of. I've never had cottage before in all the years I've been here and the first time I get it, you get to sample it as well. I'm very lucky man. Very lucky man. So um, I'm looking forward to this. So I'm gonna try out Dave has loaned me, well he's given me actually, he's a generous kind fella, this super duper new uh, wide angle lens because I'm a huge fan of wide angle photography. Uh, so I'm going to try out my uh, new bit of kit and let's see how we go. Yeah, I'm hoping that um, my voice is not too loud and yours is not too soft because of, I've never really played with this Rode mic before so it's a bit of a techie vlog. Okay. But as, um, yeah, they call it a Serb, it's a Serbian goulash. Apparently. This is the Wild West. Is this the Wild West? Proper cowboy stuff. Yeah, but proper, proper cowboy stuff is beans, and beans mean doesn't it? It does. But to cook like this, it, it's living. I mean, the what you can't see at the top of the small hole is all the vegetables. So peppers, tomatoes. Up there in the garden. Trees, etc. It's all grown here. I'm, I'm a big fan of permaculture. In fact, I'm starting to work in a... Let's just yeah. get the sun right. I'm starting to work uh, with, with permaculture. The princi principles of permaculture, and I work with a, uh, a brewery or a fermentary uh, back in Brighton. So, t to live like this, to cook like this, to provide your own fuel, to sort of work in a family, uh, it's self sufficiency. It's, it is a great way to live. So, um, yeah, let's give it a go. I'm looking forward to tasting it. Mm. <laughs> anyway, I need to do some filming. Come on. Cottlitch is finished. There it is, and it's this one is beef, pork, and mushrooms, and paprika, and carrots, and all matter of spices. And that's what we're going to have today. But all over the Balkans, this is a traditional way of cooking. It's not really a goulash. The cottage apparently is named after the the. the sort of like the container that it's cooked in and if you're on the coast the meat would be replaced by fish so how cool is that and we'll see what the verdict of the taste will be but it only went for about 40 minutes it um, really was cool great in fact <laughs> 